let's see how fast I can do this video. I have this class, it's a base, and then I have me mid and inherits from base and derived and inherits from mid, and then me more derived and inherits from me derived, and then me mega derived and inherits from me more derived. So this inheritance hierarchy is pretty deep. I'm going to show you a little bit of code that I've used a few times. I can't remember why or how, but I remember it being useful. I want to print out the entire inheritance hierarchy for me mega derived. So type type gets type of me mega derived and then uh, while type is not null let's console write line type dot name and then what we want to do is say hey type after writing the name of that class then you're going to get your base type all right control of five let's run that Look at that, we started with me mega derived, then we went up to me more derived, and me derived, and me mid, me base, and then you know object is the base class for everything, even if you don't explicitly say it. And then object, when we get object, object's base type is null, so type gets null, and then we break out of the loop. So anyway, there's you can think of this as an is operator, maybe some uh, RTTI, runtime type identification, whatever, but I'm just chasing up the inheritance hierarchy, kind of showing the inheritance hierarchy tree, you could do that searching for a class or base type explicitly if you want to, but uh, there's built-in stuff for that we've seen in previous video. Okay, short video. Hope I didn't lose you.